Good day, great please. And today we are focusing on home language. Today's lesson is all about listening and speaking. I will be your host, Arlene Andrews. By the end of this lesson, learners will be able to know and identify the food groups. They will identify the levels of a food pyramid. They will be able to create a balanced meal, syllabification, and we will focus on vocabulary. The theme for our lesson, however, is healthy eating and food groups. We will read through the following passage. Food groups. Every food is made up of different food groups. Each group gives you certain kinds of nutrients that is required for health and your body to grow. The carbohydrate group, breads, cereals and starch group is the first group or level one. It includes food such as potatoes, breads, rice, noodles and wheat products. These foods give us energy to work and play all day. The fruits and vegetable group is the second group or level two. You should eat lots of these every day. You should eat as many vegetables as you do fruits. Different colors of fruits and veggies have different nutrients and are loaded with vitamins. The dairy group or level three, it consists of milk, cheese, yogurt, cream and butter. These have lots of calcium to make our bones and teeth strong. The protein group or level four has minerals and protein to help us grow. Protein consists of meat, fish, poultry, nuts, beans and eggs. Fats and sugar group. These are sweets and treats that we love to eat but really shouldn't eat too much of. It is or has little or no nutritional value. It is impossible to eat the right amount of foods from all the food groups. The following illustration is a food pyramid. Food pyramid simply tells us that it is a triangle. The bottom part shows that it's bigger than the top part. This tells us that we must have more of the group or the level that is at the bottom than the level that is on the top. I would like to bring to your attention the following. Our yellow line shows level one. This is an indication that our carbohydrates is the biggest group. We must have between six to 11 portions per day. The green shows that this is our level two, our vegetables and fruit section. The vegetables, we should have between three and five servings. Our fruits, however, between two and four servings. Our level three is in the pink level. These are a combination of our dairy and our poultry. Between these two, we must have at least two servings per day. The top level, which indicates our fats, oils and sweets. Level four. Of this, we should have zero to three servings per day. 